learning about soil teeming with life soil teeming with life soil is one of the most important natural resources it supports the growth of plants by holding the roots firmly and supplying water and nutrients it is the home for many organisms like earthworm snail snakes and rat soil is essential for agriculture agriculture provides food clothing and shelter for all soil is inseparable part of our life there are different sources from where we find different variety of soil garden soil we find plants and grass are grown it is home for ants earthworm etc garden soil is moist and the soil is fertile there soil from the roadside is different from the garden soil the soil which is lying on the roadside is dry and not so fertile you find some unwanted weeds growing over there soil from the area where construction is going on is a mixed soil it is a mixture of sand stones cement etc information polythene bags and plastics pollute the soil they also kill the organisms living in the soil that is why there is a demand to ban the polythene bags and plastics soil profile soil is composed of distinct layers let us perform the following activity to find how these layers are arranged activity take a little soil break the clumps with your hand to powder it now take a glass beaker 3 quarters filled with water and then add a handful of soil to it stir it well with a stick to dissolve the soil now let it stand undisturbed for some time soil is formed by the breaking down of rocks by the action of climate water and wind this process is called weathering a vertical section through different layers of soil is called the soil profile each layer differs in feel texture color depth and chemical composition these layers are referred to as horizons we see five layers of particles of different sizes in the glass tumbler on the first layer it is humus the rotting dead matter floating in the soil is called humus second layer it is water on the third it is clay on the fourth layer it is sand and on the fifth layer it is gravel you usually see the top surface of the soil not the layers below it If we look at the sides of a recently dug ditch we can see the inner layers of the soil too such a view enables us to observe the soil profile at that place soil profile can also be seen while digging a well or laying the foundation of a building uppermost horizon is generally dark in color as it is rich in humus and minerals The humus makes the soil fertile and provides nutrients to growing plants. This layer is generally soft, porous, and can retain more water. It is called the top soil or the A horizon. It provides shelter for many living organisms such as worms, rodents, moles, and beetles. 
the roots of small plants are embedded entirely in the topsoil. Next layer has a lesser amount of humus but more of minerals. This layer is generally harder and more compact and it is called the B horizon or the middle layer. Third layer is the C horizon which is made up of small lumps of rocks with cracks and crevices. Below this layer is the bedrock which is hard and difficult to dig with a spade. Summary Soil is important for life on the earth. Soil profile is a section through different layers of soil. Various layers are called horizons. Soil is of different types. Clay, loamy and sandy. That is all in this topic students. Let us discuss more in the next topic. Till then, enjoy learning.